Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank on the last episode. We finished up here, sort of. And I was hypnotized, kind of. Kind of. And in this episode, now that we have an O2 mask, which we got in the last episode, we are going to go back and explore planet Orkson as Ratchet. Fly, Clank. Fly into the ship, and then the ship flies, and then we go to a very polluted planet, and explore as Ratchet. Okay, um, I know I said before that we, there are two gold bolts in this area that we can get once we have Ratchet. I kinda lied, we do need Ratchet for both of them. But we need the Visibomb gun to be able to get one of them. So we'll get that once we raise um, 15,000 bullets. The Visibomb gun is expensive. So is the ammo. Like, the ammo is really expensive. Um, but anyway, I'm actually going to go show you where that first gold bolt is. You're supposed to, or not? I guess I'm not going to go show you where that first gold bolt is, but whatever. So let's smash some crates. Jet down here, or whatever. Blast this guy to kingdom go. Probably best to just use your wrench and freaking jump strike these guys. Oh crap, no 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 no. That's sinking! Okay, and those noisy little hackers there uh, wake those guys up. You don't really want that. Because then these guys will be pain in your ass. Oh. So, if you can, you want to take those guys out first. Although I know I usually have problems doing that. Okay, so there are two paths here. Let's see, which one should we take first? Hi there, Fuzzball. Why should stop putting me on mine, Glove? I want to buy some ammo here. That's a real beauty. Let's see, stock up on all our weapons. Hopefully don't run out of bolts. Because I know we need like 4,000 for something up here. Um, should have enough. So let's go this way first. We'll come back and get it. And grab a run from this, run from this, run from this. Freaking assault ship at freaking assault ships after us now. These Blart guys really don't want to move on the planet. And again, uninhabitable. O2 masks. Hello. But then that doesn't really. I think mostly they <laughs> moved off because of the overpopulation thing. Because, you know, kind of douche. It's kind of explained why. They can't just live with their planet um, later in the game. So, kinda. Yeah, kinda sitting here questioning of the plot for that. It's actually explained and it does make some sense. Son of a. Right into the bowling. to the boiling acid of doom. I like doom. You know what? Screw this. I like Doom. So yeah, there you go. I currently like Doom enough to jump ahead to just dive into a pool of instant kill acid. And I remember dying a lot later. I just remember dying a lot on this planet. And a lot of the advanced planets, I guess. 
always always die a lot. I hope, I hope I don't die so much on film, because that'll suck. The video, whatever. Okay. So it looks like we're capped out on blast ammo. Let's take our devastator and see if uh There we go. Isn't death so wonderful in games? <laughs> yes. Seriously, if video games teach you anything, it's that it's okay to kill people as long as they don't believe what you believe. It sounds good to me. <laughs> no, it doesn't actually. But, <sighs> crap, come on, keep your foot in ratchet. Now I just have to send my little minions. Gonna have them liberate these guys. We're gonna there. I just smack that bird. Now here's the tricky part because if we go over to these things. Hit them. Er. No, not these things. Jeez, Ratchet. But I seem to recall that if we shoot those little those little orb things, that wakes these guys up. Alright, screw you, I'll just before I die, I'm just gonna send my children to destroy them. Enjoy. Yes. Enjoy my friends. Seed, I guess. Whatever. See, I didn't even took care of that very forest. How nice of it. Aren't my little children's just the best? I remember finally getting past that part um, on my last run, and then forgetting there was a gap there, and falling to my doom, and having to redo the whole thing over again. I was so pissed. So pissed. Alright, then we gotta deal with you now. easier just to run up to these guys and smack them in the head. Alright. So now... Yay! Got more ammo for my cheaty friends. Now that opens up for us. Good. And... This is a premium nanotech dispenser. Okay, yeah, shut up on the desk. Um, we can breathe in this area because of magic. Um, this is premium nanotech. It will increase our health by one unit for 4,000 volts, and then by three units for 30,000 volts. We cannot afford either of them right now, or in the foreseeable. Or really, I can't afford the second one in the foreseeable future. It's incredibly useful, but we can't afford it right now. I really shouldn't have bought that decoy glove. But hopefully, we do a little bit of bolt grinding. Actually, a lot. Right? And hopefully, I'll be able to afford both the Visibom and that premium now. Yeah, get my health maxed out to 8, because that would really, really help me. Where am I going again? <laughs> I'm a bit. 
I'm trying to remember where exactly that gold bowl is for this area. And... Come on, where is it? It's gotta be somewhere. Everything's somewhere, man. Ah. Go back to the magic zone. Ask me for another 400 points. No, no. Where the hell it is? Like, I kind of know where it is, but I can't seem to find that. And what's this? Oh, this is taking me back over here. Yeah, actually, I won't go there yet. Quite. Yet. Can I get that thing down? Maybe I have to go around or something. Hi there, no. Buzzball. Why does it keep wanting me to purchase a damn mind block? <sighs> okay, anyway. In the next episode, since we can't find that gold bolt, we're gonna be taking that other path. So, see you then.